Do you have overload rounds? No, you don't oh, need one. Just keep yeah. shooting the Kentai barrier. That's He's one thing they kind of fucked up on. Fuck. No. Fuck. I know, no. You oh. didn't do it. Clean up and move okay, out. invite Girth Rizzo well to the party. I did, I don't know what's going on. So Let me slightly. check his message. I invited him to fucking Freak. everything. Yo, I was AFK, what up? I mean, he's in the fire team, he's just not doing anything. I don't know what's going on. They're inviting to the party. And that's... It's, you know what? Black retired porn stars and... White retired porn stars matter. I don't know if. See, I'm not quite sure. On Quatifans? Not sure. What do they call it? What's that? This world's smallest country? Luxembourg? Like 290s? No. No, I mean world's smallest. Like, a. Capital? That's what I meant? Oh, smallest capital. Fuck, beats me, dude. Oh. Oh, I think the chop. Yeah. yeah. Chaz, the chop. Whatever the fuck. Chaz, Chaz, yeah. World's smallest country. Yeah, I don't think anyone that lived that is in there matters. That's what I was trying to say. Because, as we just discussed, only black and white retired. Doesn't matter. Everything else, I don't say. I mean, I don't know what the problem is. I don't know what to say. Here we are. You can burn, loot, and murder all you want. But it's... You can go beat the shit out of a Starbucks for sure. Which just probably recently, for no reason at all. Totally up to insurance premiums. You know, just just maximum insurance because they kind of suspected it was coming. You know what they were the doing? They just, and that's where the bricks came from. I figured it out. Like Show near all the big riots. From their the, I, that's where I figured out. Oh, that's freaky. fucking a badass fucking like. moat. That's fucking badass. That's a cool moat, dude. All right. I don't know what the fuck that one is, but I want to get a lucky roll and get that one. See, that's one thing I do get. It's kind of lucky. Emotes? Yeah. I've gotten some... Have you seen my new one? I don't think you have. Oh, my God. Uh, probably not. I got it the other day. I, I have it. It's, it's the longest emote I've ever seen. And it ends awesomely. This guy is not... Fuck you, dude. Jesus Christ. Walk in the soup. I tried to give him soup twice and he fucking did not want it. Okay, I'm gonna try and make this an heroic event, which means all I have to do is kill everything here. Okay, that works. No, that's here's the big dude. Here's the boss. Oh, we got him. You gonna give us a blow? All right. Yep, I got it. All right. Okay, if there's gonna be three of these, and I figured it out. Well, I didn't. I just kind of like all oh, shoot and then figured that out. Um. Yeah. That is how you uh, get it to be a uh, heroic event. Which is where I got one of my knucklehead radars yesterday. <laughs> I got two of those fucking things yesterday. Yeah, you were telling me that. It's, it's like real. It's like I mean, I, I, fuck, it is my fucking. Oh, oh, fuck! I jumped. Wow. Yeah, we, we made this soup junk. I'm trying to Overwatch here for as long as I can.
that fucker just die? He said he joined the party, but fuck. Its steady presence I don't know what happened. falters against the pyramid. All right. Pushed away on gentle ripples, darkness burrows into oh, the cosmic fabric here, Ooh. emanating distance and entropy. All right, you girthy bastard. This is not a product of design. It is their nature to divide. Up, oh, oh there you are. Jesus, fuck. Sorry. Hey, did you change it in your uh, party settings to allow your your stuff in the Twitch stream? I did, yes. Sweet. Okay, because because we actually always want to hear from a fat cock. Oh yeah. <laughs> Why wouldn't you? Oh. Um. I don't know. They got some cool new emotes. Like that motherfucker. That's a badass emote. I like that one. Oh, I want to hug him in the light. I'll hug you in the light. What do I got to do? X. 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 You gotta hold y, it. X. Oh, his head banging. I kept doing it. Okay, I don't want to fucking thing. Okay. Okay, I can't. Bastard. And where do they go? Oh shit! He's oh look! Up it on hit CD. something. Where the fuck did it hit? It go? Oh gee! Oh shit! I don't know. We started it. No, no, we didn't. I got a little. Alright, so Brody, here's the fucking here's the game. We have a game tonight. Alright. Okay. Can you hear me? What is it? Yeah, what's okay. Alright, here here's here's the game. So we have to think of new, creative, and well, preferably ultimately insulting of and, and, and I'm not saying the cause or the in this isn't good, but those crazy people among the cause that do all the shit with the Black Lives Matter and the Antifa bastards. All those crazy people causing damage. And I'm not saying the cause isn't bad. I'm just saying those people because those people are pieces of shit. Terrible. Horrible. It makes no sense. I had a big conversation with one today. Very strange. <laughs> With an Antifa member? No. That's the guy at Safeway. Oh, okay. Cashier at Safeway. It's very odd. It's, well, it's good to see he's doing uh, really good with his fucking, you know, No, morality. because here's the reason why. No, the reason. No, because he says he's been to every one of the rides in Portland and he agrees with everything. He said. They have no right to treat us like they do. And I said, I absolutely agree. But how does it make sense when you go out and be worse? And he goes, is that'll prove it to him. And I'm like, prove what to who? Again, that doesn't make sense. And I said, you're gonna be bad by, you're gonna go out and be bad and say you're not bad. Why don't you file legislature, sue people, make a difference, instead of running down to McDonald's? He goes, I never looked at it like that. I go, well, yeah. So I'm not saying you're absolutely not justified in your feelings. Your feelings are absolutely correct. It's very odd. But I'm glad I made him think a little bit. Either that or he, he didn't think. 
He didn't. No, think. he actually seen. He had. Well, he had no, a quarter of a second. Quarter of a second of. Yeah, that's a good point. And then he went right back to doing what he was doing, dude. No, no, these people it's, are it's fucking dude, brainwashed. Uh, no, it's uh, his name He's, is. Um, I I believe it when uh, I see it. Carl. Yeah. He's ring is up. He's a cool guy. I'll He's believe it when guy, I see it. I mean, and he said he only threw a few bricks, and I'm like, wow, man. But yeah, I mean, if I did, then it's just an awkward conversation. So people like him? No, I don't think he's a bad guy. Not at all. And I don't think he's down. not telling the truth or not justified. Absolutely. But, yeah. I don't think he's justified. If he's justified to do that, I'm justified to whoop his fucking ass. Well, that's his no. Then that's his mentality. Well, his mentality was no. I'm not. You know, I don't, I don't really think. I think it's more of a mob mentality. And they have because I don't think any of those. Like probably 99.9% .9 of everyone there is a good goddamn person. George Soros, oh, that guy's evil. Trying to want to decide all the shit. Now that guy's crazy. That's not cool. <clears throat> when this is all over, there's gonna be a huge public works project to fucking clean everything up. Right, well, I'm. It's you know, it's cool is uh, it's already happening. To a lot the of cleaning. Yeah. I haven't been there town, dude. I, I, I just know what I see. Oh, I'm not saying down. Oh, you're talking about the rebuilding. I thought you were talking about general cleaning. No. I was just talking about. Like, they clean up glass and shit. They're not like rebuilding the McDonald's and the fucking the three Starbucks and the Target. Not and the justice center and they're not rebuilding any of them, or the police station they're not rebuilding any of that oh shit well that goes up no but they clean up crap class okay we well. unleashed him on the pyramids so. he never did get to face his army of darkness seems like run. a lot of effort just to kill a man twice perhaps it is better to leave him atop his lighthouse sifting wheat from chaff Raw deal for the chaff. Wow. She's hardcore. But you know what? She's she is heiress. I didn't get anything. So Brody, you like being quiet because your wife's asleep or something? No, man, I'm just quiet in general. I don't know why my wife's actually out of town right now, so. Oh. Party. Well, isn't today her birthday? Yeah, she, uh, so she's going to school for cosmetology, and it's her, like, cosmetology final tomorrow. And like I said, I live in a podunk oh, town, so well, she that's... has to drive, like, into the city. So I just figured, like, uh, oh, she'd go spend the night and then get up early and go into it rather than wake up ass crack of dawn and drive, so. Yeah. Well, that's cool of you, and that's cool of her, though. It says a lot about your character. That's good stuff. See, oh, yeah. This is growing on me. No, it's good. See, that's... You're not going to go down and burn burn down a McDonald's. <laughs> yeah, I don't plan on it. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, I what would what would drive you to burn down a McDonald's and a Target? They keep fucking up my order, maybe. <laughs> oh, okay, so there is... I said no ketchup, fucking, you fucking loser. <laughs> okay. Throw well, Molotov you know in the what? drive-thru window. Exactly, you son of a bitch. I already had one ready. I'm on the way to the riots. Yeah, I could. Wow. Okay. I didn't know we were there, but you know. Yeah. All right. Cool. Okay. I didn't know. Not okay. Yeah, dude. You my. Have, uh, I burn down McDonald's. Up your that order? would be like our, our one fast food place in my town. We have McDonald's and Subway as far as fast food goes, and then like 15 Mexican restaurants because we're in Utah. So that's just how it is. But no, 
What part so like, of no mayonnaise? You will. You're the guy that burns fucking down. Fucking mayonnaise. What? What part of no mayonnaise kind of means put fucking mayonnaise on it? Tell me that. Where he gets to have this conversation with you. Showtime. <laughs> Okay, this first part is easy. I'm gonna go over here and get a bounty. Because that way I'll have more. Are they uh, fodder? An offering to our cause. So shit, that's why you're on. See what really happened? You and her, you're quiet because you and her got in a major blow-up fight on her birthday and you're feeling like an asshole. <laughs> no. No, I'm just kidding. She was actually kind of mad at me before she left, though, because I slept all damn day, but it is what it is. No. <laughs> you did? Oh. No, I, oh, I, shit, I took like an hour and a half. You were up so late. To, uh, oh. She blew it a little oh. bit out of proportion, but we're, it's all good, man. Good. Oh. You know what I'm You're a hardworking man, man. Get it. those fucking Z's. Yeah. Who gives a shit? Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm just... I'm good at telling tonality and stuff. So, nice. 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 You're good, dude. It's all but good, I, man. You know what? I did it for the stream. <laughs> you, you gotta have some content. Nice. Anything for content, man. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. We were just we were talking about we were talking about something. Just, just in oh, dude, maybe man. you could go start streaming the riots. We'll bring them to McDonald's. Uh, no, that's not. Yeah, I'm not <laughs> going I got a drone. There. I got a drone. So, I could actually... Oh, motherfucker. I could actually, uh... Almost from my house. Get to downtown? Uh, yeah. Nice. I'll drone and I'll have that shit. I, you know what? I'll stream that shit the next riot. I will stream that shit on Twitch because I have a 4K thing and my uh, drone is 5, 5G. Don't ever tell that to win on. Okay. Out. But yeah, I didn't order it like that. It just, you I would be really competing with some people who are also streaming that shit on Twitch. No, but I'll spring him on Twitch, and I'll make it my background to the entire video. Actual, true, and utter chaos. No, that I could not do. I'll joke about it, though. I could never do that. Now it's someone's making money off someone's suffering and shit. That's just, I can't do that. I just and got to Lesto. Off a random drop. Oh, dude. Oh, did you? Remember that guy killing, you, killing you last night? Yeah, that guy was freaking. I think I had our number. Oh, for yeah, sure that one guy. Night. Yeah. Did you message him? Tell him he's a little bitch. Well, he is 13. Yeah, he's a little bitch. He doesn't know his sexuality yet. Well, Media little bitches don't get. Little bitches get told what their sexuality is. Oh. Are you gonna tell me, big boy? No. I'll let you figure it out for yourself. Hey! Hey! Taking stooges are messing up my bank! No, I, I, I don't really care, like, what. Oh wow. But sometimes shit's just gay. And that doesn't mean it's a knock against homosexuality. Just sometimes shit's just gay. You know, it's like, you know, it's like, well, that's like I'm stupid. You know what I'm, I'm not really saying I hate people. stupid people. I do, you know. Uh, actually that's I Guardian Town. Shit. Back to the speech bag. Oh, go. yeah. You know what? We beat him to death with our sticks. Yes, we did. This guy's fucking what you did. Ah, oh, I was trying to get the speed.
Here's the thing I've been figuring out. Because I've died in almost the same spot each time. And I think it's maybe a super small proximity thing where you're, where you're spawned. But a lot of it, I think, is just fucking timing. At two seconds, you spawn here. At five seconds, you spawn there. Etc. I think they're gonna nerf the shit out of this gun. Either that, or this game's about to get a lot fucking harder. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I wasn't paying attention. My bad. Oh yeah, brody, you know that the, uh, the motherfucking, this game, they originally contracted this game for 10 years, not including the beta. Dang. Yeah. Isn't that cool? So we're guaranteed a 10 years of content. And like that game Anthem is kind of similar to this, the only difference is really you fly, you know? Yeah. Which is a really, and they, I mean there's a lot, a lot of it, but it's really a pretty fucking cool game. They just started out really rough, and it, you know, because of all the, they didn't have yeah, it. Yeah, well it was EA. Enough. Yeah, a lot of, well it's, yeah, but they made some good games. Oh, they so have for sure. But they don't think. They don't think ahead. Because it had the potential to be huge. Yeah, everybody was thinking how it started. Be game for sure. But. Yeah, but because they didn't have enough servers, they fucked them. You know, they, it's like they're, they, they, they fucked themselves. Because I played it since they fixed the game. It's a pretty fucking cool game. Isn't it, Alex? Uh, I haven't played in a while. I know, but I haven't either. That's why I'm gonna play with you. But I'm saying it's a pretty cool game, though. Yeah, it is a pretty cool game. I mean, if they yeah, added yeah, stuff, I'd throw the shit out of it. Oh, yeah, they have. They have already added two more fucking expansions since yeah, you and I played. Nice check yeah. it out. Yeah. Oh, wow. But it's a pretty cool game. It really is. But the first fucking few months, they fucking, they, oh, we didn't do it, oh well. Yeah, there's well, been a few I'm games lately that they've done that with. Monarch. Its steady presence yeah. falters against the pyramid. Like, uh, Red Dead Redemption had a really good story. I was excited for the multiplayer, and then they just freaking rushed it out when there was no no content at all. Now they're slowly filling it in, but nobody plays it anymore because it's not crazy relevant, you know? Right. I, yeah. I have barely started the game when I bought the whole fucking legendary thing, bought the fucking hardcover book and the special tin issue. So I was making, like, a shit ton of money then. I didn't care, but I actually like the game. It's a beautiful, it's absolutely beautiful game. But what game? Uh, Red Dead Redemption. Oh yeah. Or yeah, Red Dead Redemption yeah. Two, you know. Yeah. But it's uh, it's a beautiful game. It's just that's it's fun. A, it's really polished. Yeah, it's a, it's a, yeah, but man, the multiplayer, I. I haven't even tried it, but I heard it's, it's pretty fun now. There's, it's got some some better stuff, but at first it was just like ride around and kill each other pretty much for the hell of it, which I'm down to do, but only for so long. <laughs> yeah, definitely. So Grand Theft Auto the, was. Well, yeah, yeah, just ride around and kill so each other. And yeah, I'll, I'll do that. You know, I'll do it. I'll fucking. Go on, you know what to fuck up? Bird down, dumps. Bird down, McDonald's night. So fuck it, shit. <laughs> sounded <laughs> like you. You don't sound, but you just sounded like you're the perfect combination of 
rednecks matter. Oh yeah. <laughs> so you should you should change your name to Rednecks Matter. I'm gonna make All a right, Facebook page that. called Rednecks that Matter. That is literally the best name. Ever. We'll have Red Rednecks Matter, one, two, and three. <laughs> that is fucking awesome. You know, my girlfriend said something that was, I mean, it's not super horrible, but it kind of is. Um, we were, uh, we play pool a lot. You know, I got a pool table. She's got a pool table. You know, we just, you know, and I've spent, you know, I, I, my grandfather and a, one of the icons of pool was best friends. They went to high school together. You know, they and it had, had a gun shop together and stuff. So my first word I ever said was balls. And I love pool. I love pool. Um, I've had a few injuries, and I've had to relearn how I played with each of them, and then unlearn how I played so I can I play see. correctly, and then had to relearn again because it is the, the difference is if you hurt your elbow for two weeks and you're like a little stiff, it will affect your game for two months. Yeah. And I had surgery and a couple times and. My leg was all fucked up, and I was in a fucking brace for the fucking long, almost a year, and went through a bunch of shit, and, it, it, you know, I love the game. I'm not that good, but Time to be a good guy. I fucking love the game. Up, <laughs> so, those I fucking, it's like that, video games, I can do all those long. Oh shit, you guys weren't here yet? My bad. No, I'm here. I was up I thought... on top of the Pyramidian thing. Oh, okay. Yeah. Just, just perched like a little birdie. But, my girlfriend, anyway, the, when I was originally seeing my girlfriend, we were playing pool and she goes, you know what, and she picked up the eight ball and she shook it at me and she goes, she goes, listen! And I go, what? And she goes, black balls matter! <laughs> and I'm like, Oh my god. Because we're playing 8 ball. I see. It was just fucking cool. I don't know if you know anything about 4. But... No, I know how to play 8 ball. That's it pretty much. Scatters 8 ball, 9 ball, 10 ball. There's all kinds of cool things. Like snooker and Guardians shit. Out. I hate snooker. Snooker's on a huge table. 10 foot, yeah. high, 5 foot. I, I don't, I don't like it. My dad's from Scotland, so they played snooker a lot growing up. Yeah. Kind of a British well, I'm Irish. style. Oh yeah, I somehow got behind it, man. Oh, that way overflowed. Nice. I'm gonna go to 100 though. Uh, I killed him. But, uh, I got killed. Your wife must wanna. Graduate pretty bad. That's a little cool of her to, uh, you know, to know it's her birthday. She's like, you know what? God damn. I need to take that test. Yeah, she's had her hours done That's for like cool. two fucking years. So she's oh, wow. just like, I, I gotta get it done before it's like, before she forgets everything, you know? That's, I, I yeah. think it's so stupid. You gotta. Get a license to cut hair, like what the hell? But not have kids. Yeah, or do anything else. Like honestly, cosmetology school, they do more hours than oh, like cops do. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of retarded. Oh, damn. Guardian, 
Well, maybe they're gonna defund uh, cosmetologists next instead of the police. Oh shoot! Uh, black terms matter. Blacks don't have terms. Someone's doing that as well. Someone else did it. You know Mo got a perm? She probably looks fucking dumb with a perm, dude. No, I'm He needs curly he's hair. He's talking about it. Yeah, it's cool. It's, it's not Mo without it. You know? He was talking about it. That's the one one of the one fucking posts I did on the Facebook. I'm like, don't get a perm, Mo. Then you're not yourself, man. Then he, he sent me back a, a live message and he's all, Thank you, Troy. God damn animation, why the hell you at? <laughs> and I said, I'm a long way away, brother, but it's all good. It says, it says you're in Canada. But I know you don't like Canadians. But still, are you money, true? But yeah. Hey, you hey, taking stooges are messing up my bank. I'm doing it's weird. strictly it's Overwatch, man. I'm not even, no. Guardian down. Uh, but yeah, I fucking, I like there's a few of those guys that I miss, you know? Yeah. Like, eventually, like, I gotta, you know, we will, what we'll do is we'll, we'll test them. And they know I would do shit like this, because you're our fucking, our friend, you know? We've known them forever. And known them a lot better than a lot of people, you know? But when we left, we left for a reason, and we post up to it. But I would say, sure. we're we are at some place, and we're at, and see if oh shit, we're at some place where we're at, some place different, you know, and see if it gets out. That's what we do. If it gets out, then we can't trust them. And then we don't say anything. We don't say, hey, you lied or anything. We just... Oh, it's fine. And it's not like we're... Uh, like, Grody, it's not like we're, like, crazy... Uh, like, mass murderers or anything. I just, uh, I, honestly, it's, everything is 100% my fault. I essentially, uh, I was, you know, a fighter, down. and I had a gym, and fighters, and all, I mean, had, uh, you know, and because of that, and because for a while I was in PUA, you know what PUA is? Nope. Uh, pickup artist? Like, I essentially, I... I went through women like my underwear. Well, I was, a lot of times I would go through more women before I changed my underwear. It was like I was bad. And a few of my friends were. And Alex was. And when you do that in a small, not a small necessarily a small town, but a small suburb of the town, you run out of your... Uh, run out of um, new people because it's not that large of an area and everyone's lived there forever you know so yeah. you're like shit so now every all the women are pissed at you then half the, the guys I mean no offense are jealous because we get the attention in the women and a lot of times we would not pay for drinks or anything. We were essentially living the life if whatever we wanted. It didn't matter what we wanted, we could have it. And it made us target for a lot of people. So we just essentially just left. That's true. Like, yeah, we literally left. We didn't tell anyone we were. We just left. And with the level of popularity that we have, it was like, because I lived in the same house, in the same few 
place. He's doing the same few things for 14 fucking years. And it draws, yeah, and it, it's, I look back at it now and I'm like, I don't know what the fuck I was thinking. Because me and Alex and all my friends and fighters, we were all not doing the things we needed. Oh, I'm still not. Yeah, you are. I'm sure I'm is a lot of lust to just scraping, show up bro. and want to chat. Take a tip from your old pal. I do it better, Mr. but when someone's talking, don't watch that. I mouth. see. Whatever. No, that makes bro. sense, man. So you guys just kind of wanted to reset or whatever. Yep, we literally like house is different, jobs different. We got off social media and you know, fucking we're done. We're just gone. Let me put it to you this way. Dogs and pool table. Like, let me put it this way. Yeah, here's okay, Alex. Hold on, this is funny, but this happened. Okay. I was doing seventy in a residential in this, this small area, and this fucking cop pulled me. Oh over. fuck! And <laughs> yeah, Alex is like, Alex is like, he goes, I meant to get to work quickly. I didn't mean do this, and because I had a uh, fucking, it doesn't matter what I had. Anyways, I was driving really fast like super su like i was doing probably 75 and two blocks and cop pulls me over and he comes up and he goes can i see your lights oh shit guys what's up man how you doing and <laughs> he just started talking just for a little bit you know and yeah. because and he let me go completely i mean the guy got me on the radar everything fucking just we were dead to rights but the thing is the at a the cop was at my house like I don't know three weeks I earlier or whatever or two weekends earlier or whatever darkness and he was core. literally li I, I didn't know this at the time at otherwise I would have moment uh, had a little bit different response but um he was literally snorting coke on a hooker's ass <laughs> At one of my parties. Yeah, and he's a fucking she, sheriff. She, uh, she wasn't a hooker, dude. She was just a little fucking cokehead, though. No, that was one of fucking... Oh, oh, coke or Whatever, you know what I mean. It's still, she's a coke hooker. He's a coke whore. Buy her coke, she'll never fuck you want. Same goddamn thing. Yeah, same, money same, same want, so I understand. I understand. She's a coke whore. Yeah, it's one of fucking that blonde bitch at the time. Poor Jock got out of prison. Um, yeah, and we and we also had a guy, a really good friend of mine. He's a, he's a good person with bad habits. Um, I'll put it that way. And one of his bad habits is fighting. You know, like guys are always like at bars and stuff. They're always like, I'm the toughest guy around, and I'm this, and I'm that. And I got in this one fight, and this and that. Well, for one, he's a pro MMA fighter. I mean, and I, I, I trained the guy for fucking 10 years. He's good. You know, he's he's actually ref. I mean, not ref. Um, cornered me in a couple of my fights. You know, I mean, he's he's, he's I've known him for a long time. He's one of my best friends. He's a good guy. Um, and he happens to be the the most violently gifted person. I know. With one of the shortest tempers. But you'd never know it. Because he's like, really? You beat up six guys all at once and all you have is a toothpick. You know, because and then he's like, hmm. So you're really good then. And then that's yeah, can you there was so many fights that we got into. Oh my god. Yeah. And that's what he actually went to prison for was fighting. So. I see. Oh, that's an interesting one. Yeah, it is. It's weird. It's, 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 it's stupid. I mean, but. Yeah. When you walk into a bar and you see two women that you know, and one of them throws a drink in your face and calls you a scumbag pig. And the other and one you gives you a hug. One, yeah, it's, it's time never to move. a good sign. It's time yeah. to move. <coughs> yeah, it's too much. You, it's... <laughs> the, 
that when if that happened once, it's like, all right, dude, all right. What do you do? You fuck your sister or something? But when it happens over and over and over again, <laughs> yeah, then you fuck around and you meet a Shit. good one and you can't bring her then anywhere. You, yeah, because <laughs> it's who the fuck is fucking, Stephanie? Don't worry about Stephanie. Just, that never works. I, know. Well, I met her. I met her on the way while I was talking about Julie with you. It's like, oh my god. It's like, who the fuck is Angela? It's like, oh shit. He went there. It's like, oh my god. Yeah, it's it's rough. And honestly, our problems were all guys and women. It was it's like the people liked us or hated us. It's very clicky. You know, it caused so many problems. It had a lot of lot of benefits, and those benefits created bad habits. I was a completely different person I am now. I was a pickup before this. I was a piece of shit. And I was a nice guy. If you, if I just met you, you know, I've done this before, and it's, it's uh, bit me in the ass. But I met a guy one night. He was like girlfriend broke up with him and took his car and all this shit and took his wallet and his money and all this stuff and oh, whatever. Oh, fuck. That's yeah. Travis. Yeah. And I'm like, yes, yeah, Travis. And I'm like, all right, man, well, I said, I can't. Really do. He seemed like a nice guy. You know, well, he is a nice guy as long as he takes her medication. Well, he <laughs> took the medication. This guy is the only man in the history of time Time. Forever. I mean, I've gotten in fights in my house. I've had fights in my house. There's been guns pulled at my house. I mean, we know a lot of games this too. I mean, shit got crazy. He's the only man I've ever called the cops on. Am I wrong, Alex? No, he he's off his fucking rocker, dude. We called that the guy cops. Is, he that, needed help. That right. guy is a female. That guy is a. Wow. Fucking. Oh my god. The guy was so. That shit crazy, and I never knew it until I let him take my fucking sports car. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bad time. Uh, am to I find lying, out Alex? Oh yeah, he took the Amante. Yeah, yeah. Fucking next day, I had an Amante LXE thing was so goddamn fast. Oh my god, it was so bad. Like. It's like, it's, I mean, goddamn. I blew everything away. Except my truck now. My truck would beat it. In my day. Two mile race. It would beat it. But, um, anyways, it was a fast car, good car, worth a lot of money. And, yeah. Trying to get that car back was an act of God. Got it back though. Yes, we did. The cops came there like multiple times in a 48 hour period. Well, we didn't call the cops because, you know, we felt threatened or anything. We called them because we thought the guy no, needed no, some no, fucking no. help. Yeah, like, and I hey, here's your 5150. Or anyone else. Yeah, it's like, yeah, the guy was nuts. Like, crazy nuts, talking to himself, threatened that he's going to kill himself, but he doesn't want to die. Weird shit, man. Like, he was he was threatening himself that he would kill himself, like, like there's two yes, of them. he was. Okay, it's like, okay, it's like you heard the term, me, myself, and I, right? Well, to yeah. him, those are three different fucking people. Those are three different people. Me, myself, and I. And that's... He threatened to kill himself to himself. The guy was gone. He, he was so beyond... And I'll tell you what. Him. No, he took, he took that threat seriously, too. And then he also threatened yes, he to kill did. himself. Yes, exactly. So... What they had, <laughs> what they had was a Mexican it's a, stamp. I, I can't make this shit up, bro. I can't fucking do it. Yeah, a Mexican stamp. I mean, I wish I could. With, I, I, two dudes and him. I'd be a billionaire. You know? I mean, this is this would make a hell of a movie. This 
fucking one week span would be a hell of a movie. But the whole movie would be in his head. Because he's, he's the hero, but he's also the villain. And he's also the anti-hero. But then he's also the victim. Like some Fight Club style shit. No, but he never talked to close. Else, so. Close. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I let him... I was I let him go to the store to get cigarettes. Oh my god. If I would not have known cops and that I literally take I graduated them in the clock courses and taught the course, if I would have not have known them on that level, especially the, the lead narcotics, I mean, yeah, anyway. I, I knew some very influential and powerful cops. If I wouldn't have known them, I wouldn't have gotten the car back. It would have been gone. Well, yeah, you'd have to take, like, crazy accounts and all kinds yeah, of shit. Yeah, because he would have been basically, arrested. Yeah, you gave the keys to a crazy guy. They, they would expect answers. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. The guy was fucking nuts, man. I swear to God. I am not making this shit up. I swear to God, this is fucking so. But that's, anyways, that kind of shit. I will, I will want to help somebody because I don't want to, you know, want to be sleeping on the streets. You know. It'd be interesting to run into that guy again. No, what? You know, ten years later, on his bed, looking at me like, dude, you look familiar. So yeah, I just look and at he him actually dead in the did face. try and fight me because I was trying to save him. It was he was oh my god! Like one second he was like, "Thank you, Troy. Thank you so much." Like, and then the next second it's like, "Shut up!" And he's like arguing. The guy was gone. Like he was thanking me, but upset. So he's like was, split personality, or was he just like cracked uh, yeah, out? No, yes, yeah, but all of them were mad at each other. You know, there's, yeah, there's but no they were really all credit. mad at each other. That's the problem. You ever see that movie, uh, Bach? Uh, it just came out semi-recently. The one with a bunch of, like, superheroes and shit, but they're not really superheroes. Oh, yeah. Uh, glass? Yeah, the no, the Glass. Yeah, yeah glass. The, the dude that's got, like, I haven't seven. seen it. I need, I, need, I need to watch it. I've seen the, uh, the precursor to it. We split. watched all three in one day. Split all three in was one day. really good, but... Yeah. Oh, Split was actually the one that I was referring to. Yeah, the uh, last one. The dude that had... Glass uh, was good. Glass was good. Yeah. Glass was after Split. It, uh -huh. it, was, it was really good. It was really fucking good. But I don't like quite how it ended, but you know what? It ended semi-realistically, so I can understand that. But yeah, this guy was like that shit, but without the Split. Yeah, he was like Split. <laughs> Yeah. No, straight up. He was like trying to say he would throw him in a fighter and this and that. And what he did, he went to the bathroom and looked up an MMA fight. And he said he knew a guy that I did, uh, this guy Chael Sonnen. And, and I'm like, dude, you don't know Chael. I trained him the quest, bro. No, you didn't. And he happened to pick the same year that I was for Muay Thai coach. And I'm like, dude, no, you would have been in my class. I taught... <laughs> the advanced amateurs in the pro you did not no no you did not no you would have seen me fight you would have seen randy fight at that time randy couture and i'm like no and he was just he picked the wrong time of year for the wrong profession because he was trying to sound tough but then on the other side <laughs> but then on the other side he was like you know so i i i, I I can put your game saying. Yeah. You know, I don't I should not have done that. It's no one and then he's like completely like you up all the time. Fucking, but we go way back. Yeah, he, the, the guy did so much myself. in such a short amount of time. Yeah, it would be super difficult to even get ah, through it. Right Just not possible. Uh, Topsy, Probably plays it Topsy, no, chunk. not in this shorter time, but yeah, the guy was fucking nuts. It's it's yeah, yeah. top of the game. It's it's you know but he did he did all this stuff and all that stuff and he was also a world star chef and I mean this guy's Oh yes. <laughs> but he fucking he 
He got mad at the microwave at one point. I remember I had to talk him out of it in the kitchen. He's trying to get the microwave to work. He's like, it doesn't fucking work. It doesn't fucking work. You know, just... And didn't you say you walked over there and hit start? Or something like that? I, I don't know. Maybe stupid. I did. Maybe I didn't. I don't remember. It was something I just remember him. I just remember a man. Like that. I remember a grown man in his late 30s yelling at a microwave. <laughs> on, on, like... Couple days after Christmas. Yeah, <laughs> and, and and I also, you know, I felt bad because I'm like, it's after Christmas. This guy just lost his job. Well, he was, and his well, he was totally fine and all Phil this Gunner, kind of shit. You know? Yeah, and then he got home, and I guess his meds kind of like wore off. Yeah, yeah. Well, we also oh, fed him some, my some alcohol, God. which we probably fucking shouldn't have, but we didn't know. <laughs> yeah, now that now that I we're now like, that no, we we're like, back on that, oh yeah. yeah, your girlfriend broke up with you and she kicked you out of the house, man. That's shitty. You know I'm what? Go grab the bottle. Here. Yeah, cool. Yeah, yeah go grab the bottle. We'll on IO. Tear one up, man. We'll Merry Christmas. Yeah, we'll tear one up. Tear one up. Oh, tear one up. I'm like, tear one up. What the fuck? No. No, but yeah, he <laughs> might have been. If I he did that, that, that might answer some questions also. But No, it wouldn't. He's too active. True. What's he mixing he with that shit? That's percent. what I want to know. I don't know, man. But anyways, the guy is, was nuts. So. Oh, well, that's funny, poor man. Poor bastard. I do try and, I do try and fucking do some crucible. We did enough of this. Dude, I might go to bed, man. I'm actually pretty fucking whooped. I'd like Even today. Today was conversation. Oh, dude, today was rough. Today was rough and uh, stupid, and I was dealing with shit that I should not have been dealing with. Because people are fucking. You, what happened? Uh, what, what happened? That's a whole story. It's been, it's been going for a, a couple of days. It's just you know fucking. Oh, is that what also happened? Is a continuation what happened yesterday? Uh, well, I didn't tell you anything about it. Well, I know. I'm just saying, is it a continuation of that shit? Mm. Yeah. Oh, wow. Damn. Two days in a row, huh? Yeah. I mean, it's just it's physically and mentally exhausting. Oh, is someone call in? No, it's it's okay. Fuck it. We'll do some crucible, and I'll tell you all about it. There's there's this dude. Um, oh, it's that bad. That's why I said yesterday you need to talk. Let let me know. I don't know. You seem like you're having a rough day. It doesn't really matter. I handled it. It's just it's yeah. just I can handle myself. But hang on. Let let me pee, and then it'll load up, and we'll talk. Okay. All right. Let me go. Let me go, Tinkle Brody. Is that okay with you? That's uh, that's fine with me, man. Thank you. I just you, went Daddy. and drained the girthy rooster as well. So. <laughs> oh my <laughs> god. <laughs> oh my god. He is quiet for a fucking hour, folks. Or people. Or Edge. Um, and <laughs> and then and then out of the blue, gold. <laughs> oh, dude, you gotta, uh, you gotta log on and view this shit while you're doing it. That'll give us more views. Alrighty. Is, is Edge, uh, Edge watching I think Edge is your gonna, stream? Yeah, I think, yeah, I think Edge is gonna come back. Uh, he was, uh, he watched two of them today. So, I think he's, I mean, he doesn't, I don't think he knows quite that I can see who, it, like, sends me a report, you know? Yeah. Control. So, yeah, he, like, watched two of them completely through. It's like I'll eight hours of I'll, I'll watch this, but if shit. the internet uh, takes a shit, because I live in the country, I'm turning it off. <laughs> oh. I should be good though. I think I get like 40 megabits a second or something. So every once in a while it'll lag. 
Oh no, all you need to do is just take those zones um, and hold them to your last breath. At least like as long as you're logged in, you don't have to watch it. But like log in and and then make it a fave or like it and then you're good. Oh cool. That, count, that counts as both. Oh see. Sure. Oh wow, I got it counts as both, bro. How do you not know this? Oh yeah, we're not doing They've taken the lead. shit no more. You can turn not this tide. Yes, 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 suck a dick, Queen Bee. Excuse me. If you sucked a dick, you wouldn't be the Queen Bee. There wouldn't be thousands of dudes blowing loads in you, and you got to make as many kids as oh, possible. Well, I just okay. You're talking about blown loads, and I just got blew up by loaded question. <laughs> he gave me a load and yet literally 1046. Just, just Jesus Christ, man. These guys zone have no lost. lives. It's a power play. Get those zones back. Zone C captured. Well, if I would have been playing like maybe three, four more days. Wow, I'm getting marked every time. No, three, but you, four more days. you were already you were already pretty high when you started though. Yeah, right. I was. I was maxed out last season. Because last season was just if you ground certain things, you would Gonna advance. This is a little different. And I like it that you gotta do different shit though. 1059. Holy shit. It's nice that you can also get um Umbro and Grams just from like your regular shit too. You don't gotta go do a yes. public event a million times in a row. I'm hoping they add some like new break. guns and shit to that, because I mean Oh, they did. There's a ton of new guns, dude. Like the gun I've been using, the False Promises. I didn't like it. I'm peeking. I, I'm peeking. I, I thought it fired too slow. Like, I, I don't I don't have good timing with it. Oh, I still got that motherfucker. Oh, no, I didn't. Oh, shit, he got me. Oh, shit, Korean rice cake. We're fucked. Korean rice cake? Oh. Korean rice cake? Oh, shit. What's a Korean rice cake? Egg drop, that's what it is. Bitch. The enemy has what gained is... ground, Meaning. but it's not over. Okay, fuck this. I'm gonna get I'm Guess what you want on. This is not an vigilance in that. here away from death. <sighs> I keep trading with fags using Wither Horde. Zone C I jump no. straight up in the it's air, shoot power. it down on me, I kill get him, and then before back. I get out of the freaking AOE, yeah, you know, that's I why I hate, Oh yeah, that's why I hate the term homophobic. <laughs> like, dude, I'm not scared of fags. Like, straight up. Like, homophobia is a fear of homosexuals. Like, I do not <laughs> fear a single fag on this planet. <laughs> <laughs> be lost. Wow, I took out a couple, three of them, and they didn't do that. I mean, if you show me like like a guy that does strongman competitions and he's gay, you know, maybe I'll keep. My I crap don't shut. give a shit how big someone is, Alex. <laughs> well, what about fucking dudes that I put down? I'm not talking about you. All of them. Yeah, you're fucking dude. You will. I've never seen a big guy. You're not, you're not a small man, dude. I see no, you I mean not like got Big those, Mike. No, I mean His like name not, is Big like Mike. World's strongest man. Is what I'm saying, like. And you were like what, 17 when you know Big Mike? And he's like six six or six five and 380 fucking lost. pounds Your and a fighter. Oh, he was. 
kind of a fight. Yeah. yeah he trained hard. Argumentative. He big people. He bigged a lot of people. Minutes left. He'll, oh, yeah. He'll big the shit out of you. He's why he's a bouncer. Yeah. Anyway, Every, let me get back you know, to my... You know how many, how many times we got into fights there with Big Mike there? How many times you guys did? Well, I was kind of in and out in those days. Quite a few times, dude. Because... We would be like... And yes, Brody, you're, you're oh. keeping track correctly. I was in bars at like 17. Nice. <laughs> yeah. I brought him... Because he, because he grows facial hair on top of his facial hair. He has 5 o'clock shadow at 12 and a.m. Because he just shaved... It goes, goes pretty quick. It goes hair. pretty thick too. And, and it's thick. He's the only man I know that can donate hair don't to a bear. It's a <laughs> and be good Get in one sitting. Back. He's fucking he's fucking nah, we're solid, man. Nah, we're good. We're good, bro. Good. No. One bear man. Oh, those fuckers. One month. That's his motto. One bear, one month. I just got killed by the oh, fucking they... starter gun that you get at the start of Destiny 1, the Kyvostov or whatever. No, that thing is sick. That, no, that thing's fucking some... savage. No, that's a le that's a, the, uh... It's legendary, it's just oh, white. Yeah, no, it's, yeah. No, that gun, the specs on it and everything are insane. No one knows how to make it an exotic yet, You're defeated. but you can. Fight again. It's probably like some Pakistan shit, like Call of Duty. Yeah, it's basically exotic. So, I mean, it's it's fucking sick. Yeah, the thing is, the game is the. the I don't use it honestly because of its color, but I have and it's done well. I see. Yeah, the gun, the gun is. Pretty I did good. that. I actually went. I actually went through a kick with that for like uh, a month. Yeah, wow. I just, you did. I went through my guns. Mm-hmm. Yep. And I tried to see which ones are good. The ones that are good are actually still in my vault. I have them. Nice. Like, I, I used the cost off, mm -hmm. and then I would use, like, the white grenade launcher or some shit. It was just fucking insane. The thing, the gun I like is the, uh, the white pulse rifle. Mm -hmm. That one I use from time to time. That thing is, is got, it's fucking, it's like three quarters. Almost everything. It's it's a really good gun. I'm gonna try Telesto. Reason... Oh, dude, <clears throat> Telesto's good because it'll kill you. And let's say you miss, and you, and you don't kill him. There's grenades that are left in the air, or on the floor. What is a, such a good? If there's a group of people there, don't <clears throat> aim it at one person. Do you like uh, Telesto right... or Aaron Till? Because I was using Aaron until last year and did pretty decent Telesto. Yeah, Telesto's right? better. Teles Telesto, 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 Telesto. Because all you need to do, like, is shoot it, shoot the ground. And when someone walks over it, because everyone fucking does, um, you, they fucking, they die. They're done. It's over. Or if you shoot it on a ceiling in the hallway... Everyone runs under. You can't do anything else. You got to go around, or you're going under, and it explodes down. You're fucking done. So up or down, like in a hallway, small enclosed area, you're done. It is a <clears throat> hands down the best exotic um, fusion, fusion fusion rifle. Yeah, but the other one is uh, what the fuck is it? Um, It's, it's the fucking fusion rifle that's like the Jade Rabbit. Body shots do more damage. Oh. Uh, I I just got I got yeah. it last week. I know which one you're talking about. Non-lethal shots yeah, I don't do like that one. more damage or whatever. Yeah, exactly. Or it buffs the next shot one. or something. Yeah, I, I don't I don't like that. I way prefer Telesto. I've 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 used it for you know, I'll try I'll try every gun. Three, four days, three, four times, four, see if I even like its feel and yeah. its play style. Wow. Because I've got guns, my loadouts are fucking weird, dude. 
You're fucking weird. Like everyone, the the, gir, the gun Cerberus came out and it's got four barrels and you know it's not that accurate, <clears throat> but actually it pretty fucking is because the center left reticle will it's got amazing range. I've sniped with it, and the thing is, I'm gonna hit everything you do when you run, and they're like within. I would say. Um, within anything mid-range, if you're running up, sword, um, fucking auto rifle, anything, you're, it's, you're, it's just, you lose. I see. You've got to be, gotta be, like, you know, you've got to be partially damaged, or, you know, they're getting from, like, really far away. Control. Like that, because they fucking, it, it'll, it'll, sh it's like a fast shotgun. I see. Speaking of, I haven't done it in forever, but I'm gonna be a shotgun ape. Be a fucking oh, really? shotgun monkey. Oh, yeah. Uh oh. So, what the fuck happened to work, dude? Yeah, I know, you're probably okay. Um, take I'm actually curious, because I, I feel like life. I know a lot of the people at your work, but I've never met them. Um, some of them are douchebags. Uh, hang on. Yeah, I know. Go fucking... I, the Enemy ones I like, I, I think zone I like them. Captured. The ones I don't like, that was their boss. I oh, wow. Him. That doesn't, wow, that doesn't work very well. <sighs> don't run into groups Shit. of three, folks. Yeah, fucking Bastion. I need to get Bastion. <sighs> zone B captured. You have a bomb. Oh, yeah, I got trust, too. To get. So, uh... <laughs> There's this kid named Quentin there, right? And he's he's not. Are yeah, you talking a, about Quentin? He's a wrestler. No, 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 no. Quentin. Oh, the wrestler an, got fired, huh? Yeah, Quentin is an antisocial furry. Like he's just a weird fucking dude, man. He's a furry. Yeah, he's a furry. Oh my god, dude. And he's very open about it. Only known two. They're rare. No, he's he's very open about it. Um. And because of these, you know, management refers to him as quirky. You know, they like to say, well, Quentin's just quirky. But I say, no, Quentin's fucking weird. <laughs> <laughs> and you gotta deal with him <laughs> with a grain of salt. And every time I say that, they go, yeah. You know, like, I don't bite my tongue with these people. I refuse to. You know, like the, uh, the last um, backup supervisor, he, he did a really good job of biting his tongue and trying not to step on anybody's toes. As far as I'm concerned, I'm wearing Doc Martens and we're in a mosh pit, dude. If you get your toes stepped on, don't fucking put them there. You know, so that's my mentality, number one. So I, I talk about a lot of off-color shit. Um, a lot of it gets me so a lot of respect. So essentially yourself, and that's fine. Yeah, no, I talk about a lot of off-color shit, and people oh, I know who I am. ninja bastard. That's why. Fucking... Oh, I love you it. Captured zone C. Well, that's why that's somebody problem, bought me a hat today that says them. "Drink beer." Now hold them. <laughs> you so know, like people feel. know me. <laughs> um, but this kid, this kid Quentin, uh, he will. He does. He's he's got this kind of routine. Every, not every day, but every so often, every couple days or whatever, he'll come to me with some sort of outlandish idea. Right, just some. It, it's usually random, right? Like he came to me one day and he said, "You know what? I'm gonna buy an island." <laughs> I talked to him. This is after we had already looked into the whole Tom Hanks island thing. Captured zone A. I asked him. I was oh like, "Do you have?" You my them? God. Now hold. Well, I asked him, "Do you have any idea what that Google entails?" Maps? You're, you're not fucking you're, island. You're missing the point. That answers everything. You're missing the point. Oh, what's this? Uh, I'm saying. Okay. I'm saying that, that he comes to me with his outlandish ideas, and he tries to, to express them to me. Sorry. He yeah. Tr oh, yeah. Wow. He tries to express them to me in a way that'll work, and I will take these ideas and basically shit on them, and we both have a laugh. That's a good thing, though. Well, I do it in, in a way that's. that's do you funny. know that? Okay, Alex. Here's the one thing you said that's critical in my opinion. That I, in my experience, 
if you can shit on someone's idea and they laugh at it, it's not their idea and they don't care. You captured Zone A. You have they have no dog no, in he any is, fight he is. because they're a yeah. coward. No, he's he's out for himself and, and he's willing to be close or, or far away depending on the situation. He's he's just because he's antisocial, he doesn't know how to talk to people. He doesn't know that, that it's okay to be yourself around other people. He's just not wired that way. Um, well, dude, what's that? Uh, remember that really, really... God damn, what the fuck's her name? She's really... Probably one of, like, Cray's good friends that is, like, in my opinion, like... Really you captured hot. Zone B. And the chick zone that was dating that yours. vampire dude at his birthday like zone four years ago. Oh. Remember, what the fuck is her I name? I remember the vampire got, dude because like, I got into it with yeah. him. Yeah, I know. So did I. I did too. And Chris, that's why he left. Like, dude, you're not really a vampire, you fucking idiot. He was <laughs> totally, yeah. Like, no, he was totally into He's one of those guys, huh? You know what, uh... Yeah, I had a, another friend. Twilight's not real in, douchebag. Uh, he was a fighter. No, this guy was fucking he was weird. But he was a fighter too, and he was also in Five QA. He was, he was one of my a best friends, start. Cray. Fight on. And that's his name, not the fish, but like a crawfish. But his name is Cray. And uh, he got into the whole fucking um, hardy... EDM music, let's bounce around and, and do drugs 96% of our life, um, and let's all date each other and fuck each other and, and weird shit. His life became festivals, and he's a cool guy, I love the guy, but he had some mixed bastion, you motherfucker. The second time in the room, the son of a bitch. Um. Anyway, so he was, you know, I mean, it's all cool and everything. Um. But there's this chick. She's. She was a model until she met this dude. Four years earlier, Double five down. years earlier, no wherever it was. Oh, it could have been. Three Stand years, your ground. Long time earlier, and. She dropped out and did this and did that. Zone B, done a lot of drugs and this and that. Play. But Zone she's still, like, she's still pretty fucking attractive in any sense of the term. You know, she's it's like, she's still fucking hot. And she's also really cool. And we fucking, every time we've hung out, uh, We've laughed our asses off and got along great. She's actually zone a really lost. cool person. It's a power play. Get but those zones back. she has that, my daddy abused me, um, so I need to be with an abuser type mentality. You know, I like see. the the wife the wife Don't beater mentality. Capture. He'll slap her and hit her Three and minutes remaining. fuck around on her and just do all kinds of shit. And she's just like, well, he's being him. He's expressing himself. I'm like, <laughs> fucking no. He's being himself, that and himself him is a dick. He's an asshole. He's a fucking prick. He's got sharpened teeth, woman, like a vampire. He's got sharpened. Fucking Enemy teeth. doesn't respect your lead. I mean, Demand. come on now. What grown man Zone a says he's going you to make advantage. beats for a living? No, there's like six Zone people lost. ever that do it, and everyone else recycles. But this motherfucker, he has sharpened teeth, like they're fangs, Zone a, lost. a bunch of them, like a it's werewolf, a Get those and back. he is. You have zone doesn't shower for he fucking stinks. He does drugs 90% of the time. He doesn't have a home. He doesn't Don't have a job. Capture. That's a power play. He just you took couch them. surfs. Now He's a professional well couch surfer. He's just like, well, you know, I'm gonna surf a couch. What are you gonna do? Well, I'm gonna live on your couch next week. You know, he just goes from house to house to house. And now she's following him. But Those she also control. has a job, Targets and she also eliminated. has the car, and she also has the dental insurance. Which he obviously has not taken care of. But <laughs> anyway, you know, the guy. I mean, he. I mean, he literally like spent money on 
uh, having a tiger implant for his whiskers. You have to have these little holes implanted in your skin and then your skin has to accept them. And then after that, after you do that, you grow whiskers, which it Crazy. Says, it's, I told him. All right, and, and time I'm like, out. Dude, I got to swap batteries. Like... Okay, Real quick, all right. My controller's going to die. My stories are off the hook tonight, dude, and they're fucking, dude, this is all fucking reality. Yeah. They're fucking so weird. Alex, we've had a crazy life, you know that? We have so done, far. We've a lot, our lives have been, you know, a lot of it is, you know, you know, I mean, you know, just, you had a tragic event and, and. Oh, well, Dramatic, life's a bitch. Tragic event and all Speaking that of and dude, that like, song, that know? song I sent you, it's called "Life's I didn't a listen Bitch." To it yet. It's except yeah, I was they dropped to... a song last year. What? Yeah, they're still doing I... shit, bro. Is it still like '80s death metal? <laughs> Fuck yeah, it is, or like dude. <laughs> grind metal? Oh my god, that's awesome. Fuck yeah, it is, dude. It's like they never true. grew up. Mm, they never grew up, bro. <laughs> Forty that's years later, still awesome. cranking it out. It sounds like the first album, but it's just it's Dave, it's put together their better. First album, it sounds like rhythmic? it, yeah. Oh fuck yeah, it is. They dropped a song. It's called oh, "Life's a Bitch." Interesting, because their first album I really liked, and then they had "Balls to the Wall," and then they kind of and then they had um, "Smithereens," and then they kind of dropped off the face of earth. Or, or I or I lost track of them, but did they drop a song? Yeah, I was checking them. I was checking them out today. They have this song. It's called uh, Kool Aid, and it's about uh, 1978 when that dude uh, fed everybody oh Kool Aid. My God. Oh shit! And they're like, "Don't wow. drink, don't drink the Kool Aid." Um, and it's like, "Fuck!" If bro. they dropped that recently, that's not in reference to it. I I will I will. Uh, I'm gonna listen to the song and I'm gonna figure it out because I, I just the taunt, just that in and of itself sounds. Uh, 2017. No, it, it directly references that. Like, yeah, I know. It, it's the story. Oh, of that. it does. Are you sure? Yeah, I listened to it. it it's a direct reference. Yeah, because yeah, yeah, that hmm, maybe it is. That's fucking awesome, um, buddy. Fuckhead. It's on uh, the rise of chaos. Oh, did you, is it that uh, your air conditioner I put in there? I know I've seen it. That uh, air conditioner is two degrees cooler. You put it on like sixty-seven. You're gonna be sixty five degrees. Freeze your fucking ass off. Okay. Well, yeah. keep that in mind. And keep it on an energy saver. Otherwise, it runs in there, and it'll say sixty-seven, and it'll, and it'll be sixty-two. Okay. Yeah, yeah it's it's cold. Oh, okay. I like this one. Uh, I'm still shocked I'm on King. Fuck it. Really? What'd you get yeah, I did time? pretty good last time. I don't know. I was, uh. I don't know. We won, so. So, anyways, uh, antisocial dude um, comes yeah. to me with crazy ideas. And I shit on him, and we have a good yuck, and, and you know, that's sort of, that's not the entirety of our interactions. There are some things that he asks me advice on, because the kid's got two um, well, how social interactions. Uh, he's 22, zone a. Zone C, 22, about 6'1", uh, like oh. 22, 6'1", probably 150 pounds. You captured zone B. Oh, he's a, he's a rail. Advantage. Yeah, he's a rail, dude. Um, oh. Wow. Zero self confidence. Um, he's well, I been would have with zero self confidence as well. Zone C lost. Uh, no, he's been with um, one girl his entire life, and it was one oh. time. You know, so I've offered. I offered oh. to take him to the bar. I'm like, dude, fucking come with me to the bar, bro. Like, we'll I'll I'll handle some shit for you. Like, don't even yeah. worry about it. I'll do it as a fucking favor. Just, you know, hook it up with a beer here and there. Dude, the Crocodile Dundee rules. You know me. You know. Right, yeah. Buy me a cold one, we'll call it straight. Um, yeah. It's, you know, it's the way I operate in life. And well, it's starting to pay off. Yeah, I'll do it. That'll be fucking great. 
Yeah, and he lives in Sandy, too. And he lives up the street from a little bar. So I was like, dude, you've already got, like, you've already got all the answers right here. It's a power play. You literally those zones back. got the answers. <laughs> like, just let me show you how to put it together, you know? And he, he won't do it. Um, that's part of his identity, is being this antisocial creature. Wow, somebody um, is firing that shit like crazy. Oh, like, uh, he's... Ground, and I, I, I'm prefacing this because it's... It's fairly serious not you know serious for me or anything but it's important to preface it right um to get the the personality and in, in the oh, best yeah. possible um bell winter's live bastard um so he comes to me on friday friday right as we're leaving and he asked me do you know anybody that would break into anybody's house? And oh. can I'm I'm thinking because he's come to me with crazy shit like this before. Okay, I'm thinking he's full of shit. How can I not? And I go, well, whose house is it? And he goes, it's my mom's house. Tell him that. You know, like he said, that's your mom's did. house. No, it's his <laughs> mom's house. You already told him someone. No, I didn't tell him anybody. I was fucking with him. You said Cash or Bam, right? No, I didn't say any names at all. I was fucking with him. Oh, okay. I thought you. I was completely no. No, 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 no. Because I thought one of I thought he was full of shit. No, 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 no. Um, I thought he was full of shit, right? And so I'm like, of course, man. Like, what do you need? He goes, oh, yeah, it's my mom's house. And I go, oh, it's your mom's house? Whoa. Oh, you're talking like 14 grand. You know, and every time he said something, I would up the price because I'm fucking with it. You know, I'm not serious about this at all. And he kind of laughs it off, whatever. And he, he mentioned on Friday that he wanted some photo albums. He goes, you know, my mom will let me have my photo albums. And I'm like, okay, just go over and get them, dude. And he goes, well, I'm not allowed at the house. I'm like, well, just go knock on the door and, and get your photo albums, dude. And he goes, no, you're not understanding me. I'm not allowed at the house. And I'm like, okay, whatever, dude. And I kind of schleffed it off because so I wanted a, to he's go got, home. If he's got at least a 50-yarder, which is one block, one city block, then he's done something, something questionable. Uh, what do you mean he's got a 50-yarder? Like a house? He can't go to the house. Rest no, yeah, restraining an order. No, no, I'm not. That's, I'm not. Well, I'm talking about being beyond, beyond a restraining order because restraining an order. If he lived there before, he can go over there as many times. It's almost unlimited. If he tells the police ahead of time and gets an escort. <coughs> that's, that's. I don't a think. Thing. I don't think so, that there that his mother placed a restraining order on him. Oh, I okay. would find it right. very hard pressed to find that. I think she told him, "I don't want you at the house," and he took that as law. I overthrew that. Goddamn. Top you see what I'm saying? Know, if my, if my kid was a furry, I would definitely get a restraining order. Only five minutes left. If my that's, free, that's, if <laughs> no, you know what I would do? Here's the way to say that. If my friend, if my kid was a fury, I would say, Alex, get a shovel. <laughs> okay, we're not. <laughs> because we, okay. we got places. We can hide bodies. And we know people. We're good. I'll kill two people. Yeah, right whatever. But... No, but I need to. I'm just talking shit. But yeah, I'd say get a shovel, dude. It's fucking crazy. So, okay, so uh, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, okay, he's a little seen about something and he's just coming to me with some bullshit. It's Friday. It's we're leaving. We are leaving. Right, and so I'm like, yeah, just whatever, dude. And I kind of schleft him off, and I left. Um, most of Monday goes by, and and he was very bold to do this because he did it in front of people. He brought it up, and so it, and this oh, is after God, about yeah. seven or eight hours of work. So he's actually right, but I. Also. Right, <laughs> I understand this, 
but he did it in front of you know God and creation basically he did it in front of no less than six or seven people you know asking me this and once again I was oh, wow. fucking with him I'm like of course bro like what do you need what's going on he's and he's telling me more and more information. Oh my god. That, Don't be Captain. That oh, this one is have like, advantage. Hopefully thought about calling the police because he's breaking into your mother's house. That's 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 not not cool. No, it's I your remember mother. his work. And yeah, I also got that's, it. That's I also probably got it in a text message choice. um to my supervisor, hey, I need to so talk to you about lost. Quinn. Like I did that um good yesterday. Like I did So so I, I three minutes Yeah, left. I handled it. Um, but you know, he's just giving me more and more information. I realized he was serious, and I asked him dead to his face. I go, "Have Don't you ever be been in a fist fight before?" And he said, "No." <coughs> I go, "Well, then nobody's ever gonna do shit for you." Period. Like you will never find somebody. And I, I just kind of put it like that. Like at the Your moment, I realized he was serious. This time. Uh, the next day, I reported it. Um to my work there's there's only so much they can do but he's on the radar um, my supervisor wow. being from from El Salvador is got his eyes on it too so both of us are have been watching him um, um, oh my god dude Tuesday, Tuesday shit. during during the day um, I go up and I was <laughs> I just handed him a couple things to do because that's within the scope of my job. And uh, he's like, "Oh yeah, so how much were you talking about again? Was it twenty grand?" And I just looked. I was like, "Jesus Christ, dude!" But this is already after I had the meeting. So. Oh my God. So I basically, you know, gave it a continual report. Report. Um. And on top of that, he's been so like, not, um, so not. purposefully, purposefully um, uh, messing up his job. Up his job. So, he's so he's doing all the he's all he's the doing like a bunch of wrong things. He's misfilling orders. He's um, yeah. fucking things up, damaging things. Oh, he things. works at McDonald's, huh? All right, no, he's dead tonight. <laughs> Brody killed him. Remember? No, you bear. Oh yeah. No, oh, yeah. he didn't. Yeah, I looked <laughs> it up on his nose. He was in the building. Yeah, probably kill the man tonight. Good. Yeah, furry lives yeah, don't furry matter. Lives. That much <laughs> is a furry lives don't matter. Furry, that's the furry, best one tonight. Furry, furry lives, lives don't matter. matter. That's awesome. Anyways, go ahead. No, but but no, so no, I've had no, to no, um, basically watch him watch with an eagle eye. Uh, my supervisor's been doing the I same, doing and he's yeah. just. He's just so full of piss and vinegar. I know he owns a gun. He owns like a he owns a uh, Beretta That's, or something. I think. Alex, all right then. You need to. All right. All right. Well, that's not cool. If he, yeah, that's so not cool. Wow. Well, I've been dealing with it for a couple days, and it's just you know, one of those fucking things. I have never seen this. Unable to find a match for your team. Every other player is lower level. What we didn't do that great. I think I got. I think I got. One of you had four, and the other I got I two killed or something. Or yeah, I don't know. We're yeah, we're whatever. just sitting here talking, but yeah, that's fucking. And I am that good. Crazy. I can get four, <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> but, but yeah. So I've been I've been dealing with that, and you know, keeping updates on certain things. Plus, wow. there's you know various other dramas that have been going on just you know par for the course type shit but you know nothing nothing too out of hand um but it's i i think i think me doing what i did has has very much solidified me because i reported something like that you know i reported some dude that that was that that's drunk scary there's shit a the other lot day. of signs Oh, that's yeah. to drunk dude. Oh no, different guy. I was just, oh. I was just saying. How some, many drunks are you work? That deal uh, with like heavy five, machinery. Solid. That are five like solid thousands, and then not including the low, which is going to depend upon a density. But yeah, five Jesus solid. Christ, I'm telling you right now, there's five of them. <laughs> wow. 
Wow. It's just it's just the way it is. But the the dude that was that was dr- I told you about that. The dude that was drunk and breaking shit. Um, his dad is the division manager somewhere else, so he gets a little extra special pass. Oh, so mm-hmm. there's the reason why he's a furry. No, 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 no. This is a drunk guy. Oh fuck! All right. Well, that's cool. No, different right. guy. Well, that's his not name's cool. Kenny. Not cool. Not cool. <laughs> no, his name's Kenny. Not cool. Sorry. Not cool. I'm not saying that's cool. I'm just. I've taken I've taken a very strong stance with Kenny because he says what's up to me once in a while, and I'm like, fuck off, Kenny. That's the stance I've taken with him. Wow. Hmm. Wow. Did you guys maybe get the, the game's same... getting fucked up? Yeah. No, so yeah, I got the air air code. News. Let's just uh, yeah, let's like go. Unable to... Let's break it up. It's a strike. Oh, really? Okay. All right. Fuck. All right. Just All give right. it time uh, to reset or whatever it's going to do. Uh, all right. So, do we, let's, you know, let's, you want to do Nightfall? Yeah, that's fine. Okay, but what? Adept, Hero, Legend, Master, or Grandmaster? Uh, what's your light What's your light level? I'm 1,015. Brody's 1,004. Okay, we'll do Adept. So, just the base. But yeah, no, it's been uh, it's been a crazy week, man. Wow. That's you know that's part of why I was saying well, I knocked good, back though. a few that's... beers in the driveway with my supervisor. You know he needed that shit too. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. But I was saying, Brody, as funny as I swear to God, I literally had my last boss arrested by the FBI. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But was Edgar? I told him. I said, "Dude, I said, one of my good friends." I'm like, "Hello, something, something, something." And he's like, "He's like, yeah, it, yeah." He tried to hide shit because I had the, uh, it, you know, I was uh, a manager at a flooring store, which is weird, but I made pretty decent money, and life was great because. I was it was I made a very good hourly wage and they had commissions and then I had other shit so I was making really good money <clears throat> because I don't bullshit people I'm like I'm not gonna sell you something I'll tell you info and then you decide if you want to buy it. I'm not gonna pressure you to do anything and I take I'm gonna tell you info and what we got our sales we always have a sale don't think you gotta buy it I would just be honest with people yeah I would not lie to him. But like, oh, this is the greatest. I would never. I'm not one of those people. Like, yeah, I, I sold countertops for like three years. I kind of did the same thing. Yeah, I'd be like, hey, man, this is what it is. And, you know, and then they would be like. Really? Oh, I've got another so, error code. Yeah. Error code so new. Let's weird. see what it is. And I'm like, all right. So, and, but, so you I got did an error code really well. I did, yeah. Yeah, so I ended up doing really well. So I had, but my boss was fucking around with. Uh, do you know what the FCC code, FCC code means or anything like, like kind of what it may be? Um, the, if, I know the FCC they, like, I mean, they are the, and the, control the like radio frequencies yes, and different frequencies the, of all like electronics yes. and stuff. But well, yeah. the equivalent to that is the FTC, the Federal Trade Commissions. And that has to deal with imports, exports, and there's one thing that you do not, even on a low level, is fuck with. And that's only one thing. They're called commodities. Commodities, something everyone needs, no matter what race, religion, color, or creed. They're just, bam, everybody needs it. Water power shit like that um uh when it comes to mercantiles which means flooring wood flooring it's a commodity you don't fuck with it they were actually him and three other managers i figured out up and down the entire coast from california to uh seattle were (laughs) Basically working together because they all started at the same store, and <coughs> were 
they would go and like a super high profile thing of wood that's worth like 65 70 grand would disappear because they were all managers it would just disappear and it would happen every couple months and then what would happen is I'm like, so, cause I ended up selling three or four of these hard to find and hard to do things just because these people had money and they told me they did. And I'm like, that's really cool. Here we go. Um, what do you want? And they're like, we want the best. I'm like, well, this is the best and here's why. So they ended up buying it a few times. <clears throat> well, when I sell like $100,000 order, and to win the contest, I only need 35,000. I mean, I went it with one sale when I won it the two months prior. So I'm like, what yeah. the fuck? Yeah. Anyways, long story short, they ended up saying, oh, I refunded that one. You fucked up and he would try to blame it. Well, the first few times that happened, I'm like, something's wrong. So I, I'm pretty good with computers. So I go in and I look and I, Told him this and I hacked into his email and stuff and he was literally I got it all fucking his emails and all that between everybody and yep he come in he's he, he's gonna be in jail for a long time that's funny yeah weird it is yeah. what it is so yeah when Alex like comes back and he's like hey I fucking reported somebody or something. That's, that's pretty cool because here's something that's odd. But if you think about it, you can't undo a wrong. You could try and make it better. You can try and make up, but you can't undo it. Yeah. And fucking people For sure. are like, oh shit, you know. So I've always, yeah, dude, that's, once I that's... once I realized that you know, all this shit's happening, I people wrong, and I was doing the people I wanted to straighten my life. <sighs> shit, this shit's just not working. Yeah. Hey, we should just call it. What do you think? Call it. Or we go back to the tower first, then call it. We can get our umbrellas and but, go to bed. Yeah, let's go to the tower. For the lettuce. Yeah, I'm done. Yeah, yeah, man, that's my favorite thing about my job now. I just I started like six or seven months ago, and it's just shift work. So it's me and three other dudes that are all pretty pretty good guys. I feel like I'd cool. go to war with them. We freaking go to work for four days, get it done, and then never hear anything about it when I'm at home. Don't have to think about it. Don't have to worry about yeah, it, awesome, anything man. at all. My phone doesn't ring. My last job nice. doing sales, my phone is just constantly fucking ringing. Cause oh, it was yeah. like a pretty small company, so we were in charge of like the scheduling for the next day and stuff. And our Did installers and shit, our installers and shit would. Uh, yeah, I sold the uh, roosters. <laughs> oh, really, but, that's uh, awesome. Yeah, so our you installers kept, you kept just, the girthy one. <laughs> yeah, the good ones I kept for myself for sure. Yep. Took him home. Yeah. That's fucking crazy. Yeah, but I ended up fucking... That's another thing. We ended up having seven break-ins. And I would have to... Get up. And the thing is, I know, that's what first tipped me off. The break-ins would only happen... On the day that he was going to have two days off or three days off in a row. So he left on mm. Friday, and then Saturday, Sunday, Monday was a three-day holiday. The break-ins would happen then. And after seven of them, I'm like, are you fucking kidding me? Why does it always happen then? i got to be there from open to close, three days in a row. I'm going to put in fucking 36 hours just in three days minimum. That's if I work open to close, which I always worked overtime. You know, it's fucking, I would, this is not fucking working. I left the fire oh. team, I'll just go to the tower oh. on my own, see if it works, but. 
Yeah. All right, man. All right. Well, fuck. Yeah, it's fucking. Yeah, we like to do the good things. Long story short. That's good, man. <clears throat> what do is, it sucks doing so what do you go to sometimes. jail for? Like fraud and like just. No, I never went to jail no. for fraud. Import. I got no, what did he go to jail, go to jail for, for? Fraud and, and shit, but. Uh, I went to jail for trade, the... No, trade commodities, theft, and a bunch of other shit. Let's see. Which has uh, yeah. got a nice stint in the federal pen for that shit. Yeah. They don't. Yeah. They don't like state Most crimes. Most people don't you, know, but federal commit... crimes start at ten years. Yeah. Well, they state crimes nice really start they, the, they have. They have the, the option. To... crime, though. Yeah. Yeah, they have the option to plead down. Federal crime. It's like you're gonna do this or more. <laughs> if you get charged with a federal crime, it's because they got that shit dead to right. So they're not gonna charge you otherwise. Like there's people that have been under FBI investigation for five, six. Seven. Wolf of Wall Street, great example. Like he was under investigation yeah. for seven years or some shit before he was charged. It's like yeah, the moment they charge you, it's broker they got it. Different. He sold. No, I'm, I'm saying, I'm saying, yeah. I'm saying for federal crimes, if they charge you with yeah. it, it's because they have it. You yeah. know, and that's where like people don't understand what a FISA warrant is. A FISA oh, warrant is, is, is that's they, worldwide. They, they've You're got done. plenty. They've got plenty, but they can get more. Yeah. You know, like. <laughs> yeah. See shit, if they can't take it from either. from ten years to twenty five or. 40. Yeah. And the thing is, mm -hmm. I mean, he was 23 years old. Damn. Um, oh, yeah. That was super yeah, he was. He was fucking young. Yeah. 23 years Steroid old. Steroid job, too. Yeah. Well, fucking, well, he paid for that shit. I mean, he told me he did, but I mean, because he worked a lot. <laughs> he worked almost as much as I did. But... Yeah. Are you in the tower, buddy? <laughs> I am, no. yeah. It let I'm me on go. The way. No, it it bounced us. I'm going to the tower by myself. Yeah, I was pissing. But yeah, it's uh <clears throat> yeah, I mean it sucks, man. It's like That's crazy he was dude. that young. Yeah, it's sad, man, because I know that I know that he's a decent guy and I know he felt bad for what he did because I only offered asked for like two days off you know and he yeah. you know he I understand his verbiage and what he meant now but the way he said it was odd yeah he's I don't, I don't give a shit yeah I, I don't give a shit about all that I mean I'll make it work you know I'm not picky you know I'm just, I want the store to do well also you know I mean because it's better for me because the company I mean it was lumber liquidators they paid really well and their bonus structure was fucking amazing you know I mean I remember I mean it was on the lower level but I remember it got $1,800 <coughs> bonus track Twelve hundred dollar bonus check added on to my regular paycheck. Sometimes, once a month, twice a month. It just depended on how they ended their sales program. But yeah, nice. we're fucking. It was. I mean, I'd be like, all right, well, fuck. I mean, it's like an, I was. I could almost always, always count on it. I mean, at least twelve hundred. You know, so it was pretty cool. It is cool. Then he had a good wage and regular bonus structure, so it was really cool. It was, it was awesome. But then I got fucking hurt when the new boss came. If I would have known that would have happened, I would have never done it. Holy shit. What'd you get? I got a bad omens god roll. What is it? Um, okay, so smart drift control. Implosion rounds, tracking module, and Genesis. Well, that's the so, first good bad omens I've ever had. Huh. Well, that's.
because they don't have cluster for bad omens. But yeah. No, they don't have for that. Yeah, but uh, tracking That's module in cool. Genesis is pretty fucking sick. Well, Genesis, if it's a boss, is like PVE. That's a fucking Ooh. PVE grenade launcher because it's way better than fucking um, cluster bomb for a boss. Everything else, cluster bomb's better. But that's one I would keep with me along with your. Yeah, I got the Zenobia, Zenobia if I need rockets, yeah. you know. I just got a. Explosive payload snapshot sites night watch. That's a pretty decent roll. Oh, 